let's walk through how to set up your Lexus app. Once you download the Lexus app, it's gonna look like this. If you already have an account, go ahead and sign in. If you don't, hit register and continue to registration. You'll fill in all of the lines, you'll create your own password, and then you'll hit register. It will send you a verification code to your email. If you don't have access to your email, you can just hit the back button and then sign in with your phone number. So once you sign in, this is what your home screen will look like. You'll click add a vehicle and then you can either scan or enter the VIN number. Once you type in the VIN number, it'll say add your vehicle, scan QR code or connect by code. So then you are going to hit English on the screen, then you'll hit continue and you'll type in this code that appears. Once it loads your vehicle in, it'll show this screen, just hit save changes. Normally after you hit save changes, it'll have you create a pin number that has to be six digits. I recommend birthday, anniversary, combination you remember super easy. Then once you confirm that pin number, it'll bring up this connected services trial. You'll hit continue. Then this top one just allows your vehicle to communicate with the service department of your choosing should there be something wrong. The next one allows the service department of your choosing to reach out should there be something wrong with your vehicle or it be time for service. And then you have 30 days or three gigabytes of Wi-Fi. And then after that, it is a charge through AT&T. Um, most people choose not to use it because they have their hotspots, but it can be nice if you have people who use tablets or computers in your vehicle. And then you have external video capturing. This will help capture things in case of diagnostic needs. You'll hit confirm and continue. And then it will bring up, it will show you your VIN number at the top, your odometer underneath that and your range. So how long till E? You have your lock, remote start and unlock. You'll wanna make sure all keys are out of the vehicle and that you lock the vehicle before you remote start the vehicle. On certain models, you can also swipe up and change the climate as well. It will auto adjust to the temperature outside. So if it's hot outside, it'll cool your car down and vice versa. You can also find where your vehicle is located via the app as well.